Hello folks, welcome to Sherwood Park Toyota located at 31 Audubon Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Today I'm going to be showing you this 2010 Dodge Ram 1500 SLT. Now the most notable features on this SLT is its backup camera. You also have your soft tonneau cover along with your Bluetooth in there. Now I'm going to go through a couple more features on the inside and outside of the vehicle just to get you better familiar with this 2010 Dodge Ram 1500 SLT. Let's get started. Now a couple of the exterior features that you will see on this SLT is its daytime running lights. And then if we take a closer look just over on the side here, you'll see your 17 inch aluminum alloy wheels along with your running boards. Taking a look, as you can see, you have your foldable mirrors, but the other nice thing is they are the uh, tow mirrors. So the nice thing with that is that you can actually turn them up like this just so that if you're hauling anything then you can get yourself uh, a bit better view just when you're towing something and the color we're going to be taking a look at today is tan now to start off with we're going to be taking a look at your front dash as well as your front seats just so you have a much better idea of how much space there is now as you can see you have your black and gray combination seat surfaces with your power driver seat with lumbar support you have your light controls and then on the inside of your driver's side door you have your mirror controls, window controls, window locks and power locks. Now a couple of the controls that you'll see on the steering wheel here are uh, the scroll function here for your multi-informational display which I'll show you here. Now, taking a look here, as you can see, just scrolling through, you have your fuel economy, vehicle info, as well as a couple of other additional features. Now, at the very top of the menu, you have a uh, digital compass as well as an exterior temperature gauge, odometer reading located down below. And taking a look at your center dash as well as your display, as you can see, you have your digital clock as well as your date and time on there. Well, I already said time, but anyways. Uh, if you go through the menu screen right here, as you can see, you have a couple of different options for yourself. And then going into the settings menu, you can adjust a couple of things through here as well. Now you do have your tow haul as well as your traction control on and off, as well as your uh, hazard lights. And then you have your temperature controls just located down below here. Now it is matted to a automatic transmission. And if we just throw this into reverse, as you can see, you have those nice guiding lines in there making things much easier for you when you try to back into a stall. Finally, we'll be taking a look at your rear cargo bed as well as your tailgate. Now, located in the center of your rear bumper, you're going to see your connectors for your towing. And then just on the back here, you'll see your uh, lock for your tailgate. And then your backup camera is actually going to be located just down below here. Now, closing in on the rear cargo bed, I'm just going to show you a couple of things in the back here. But the nice thing with this SLT is it does come with the soft tonneau cover. So if you want to place any uh, cargo in the back here without fear of it getting wet or possibly people seeing it, then it definitely comes in handy. And then you have a couple of areas located over on your left and right hand side where you can actually tie down some loose cargo just so it's not uh, shifting around in the back of your bed while you're driving. Thank you so much folks for watching this video today. If you have any questions on this 2010 Dodge Ram 1500 SLT, please visit us. We're located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. The phone number is 780-410-2455 or please visit our website at sptoyota.com to get us by email. Once again folks, thank you so much for watching this video today. If you have any comments or any additional questions, please leave them in the comment section located down below. Other than that, make sure you have a great day and I hope to see you next time.